use this as a tripod. Okay, that works, I think. Good morning, my loving Tiffany Thinks family. I am so sorry about my hair. <laughs> Hold on, let me try and fix it. I'll sort out my hair in a little while. Good morning, my loving Tiffany Thinks family. How are you all? I feel like I want to do kind of a little catch up with you this morning because um, I have been picking up the camera, you know, to vlog, but I feel like I haven't told you kind of what I've been doing. So um, I want to go back to work. Um, I'm still not able to sit on my bottom. I'm sure you're all like fed up of me saying I'm sitting side to side to side to side and I prefer to stand up. I still don't feel comfortable to kind of sit on my bottom yet. Um, and I have got an appointment with the plastic surgeon soon. So the plastic surgeon, he's the one that did the kind of, kind of the last bits on my bottom. So I wanna ask him like how much longer, I'm not kind of rushing it because I know overall it is kind of a, it is a really big surgery that I went through. Um, but I have recovered very well, um, so hopefully not too long and I'll be back to work and I know everyone's like don't rush back to work but for me I actually like enjoy, I enjoy what I do so I can't wait to kind of go back to doing that. If you guys don't know I'm an optometrist, um, I will sort out my hair, um, but yeah if you guys don't know I'm an optometrist. I wouldn't go back to working kind of like every single day like I used to. I'll go back like the occasional like weekend or I'll just go back kind of the occasional day here and there. I think that'll be good for me. And in the meantime, I've been studying. So um, in order for you to practice, you need to kind of have a certain number of kind of, they're called CPD points. So in order for you to be able to practice every year and practice with patients, you need a certain amount of points. So I've been studying and I've been trying to get those points. Um, I've got most of them. I'm kind of, I like being on top of it. Even when I'm not well, I always kind of, I'm always kind of studying and I like reading and so yeah, I've been on top of it in regards to the CPD points and um, so I'll be okay to go back to work when I am ready. I also um, started a course and the reason why I started the course was because firstly I was bored, secondly I was interested, thirdly I like studying and even though I'm not able to sit on my bottom, I thought I could do this course even when I'm in bed. Um, there's so much Netflix I can watch. There's so much, you know, I can't, after a while, you just kind of, you can't keep watching TV. And um, I got bored, so I thought, let me start a course that I want to do and um, something that I can do at my own pace, at my own time. Um, where I don't need to go into kind of college or university, just something I can do online and have kind of my assignments and essays all signed by and I have a mentor and everything and yeah the course is life coaching and I've always kind of, I've always I've always thought I need a life coach, I always thought I need, when I was having like financial when I wasn't able to sort out my finances, I was thinking, oh, I need to get a financial life coach or like with my job, I wanted a life coach. And I thought, you know what, why don't I study it? And then I can help myself and maybe I can help someone else. And it's just more kind of for me, for me to just enjoy, take my time with it. Um, I've sent off my first assignment yesterday, last night. So I've got like a little bit of a break before my mental kind of signs it off and gives me feedback. So yeah, that's the little update. I don't know, I feel like, I think where I'm not able to do a lot because of my bottom situation, um, I still have a little bit more healing to do. And I'm kind of getting used to the stoma bag as well. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm still kind of trying to figure that out as well. And it hasn't been, like there's days where I think, yes, I can do this, yes, I can do this. And then there's days where I'm like, I can't do this, I need to call a nurse, I need help. And then I kind of figure it out. So it's all kind of 
been an adjustment to this new body and so that's why I'm kind of not being harsh on myself because I have had the most craziest time ever and you guys know you've been on my journey I don't, don't want to talk about I don't want to mention the c word um the c word as in not the swear word you know what I mean um I got an Amazon delivery yesterday um and I ordered this book I feel like everyone this has been on my wish list for a long time and um I don't know why I didn't pick it up earlier or I don't know why I haven't read this um, and it's called Atomic Habits. I have a list in my bullet journal. I always kind of write down a list of books I want to read and this was on the list. I'll let you know how I get on. I am going to go back on the Tiffany Thinks book club page on Instagram. I know that page has been like neglected and I am going to go back on it. So. I'll talk about this on there, tell you what I think, if you're interested. <laughs> Lots of little updates this morning. Another little update is that the past few days I've been trying to wake up early. Um, so I set the, because I am, um, before all of the things that happened, before the C word, I've I used to wake up every day at five o'clock before work and I used to get lots of things done and I was very productive and um, then obviously things happened and I, yeah, I just couldn't have a routine, like it wasn't possible. Um, whereas now I am trying to go, trying to go back to um, how things used to be and I've been waking up earlier. It's only been a few days, so I'm not sure how long it will last, but I've been waking up earlier just so that I can kind of study, do a little bit of admin bits, do YouTube bits, and yeah, so I wake up earlier than everyone else. So Amma and Matt are still snoozing away, um, and I kind of sneak downstairs, um, and I get my bits and bobs done on the sofa actually, so I'm on the side and then I move on to the other side and I move on to the sofa. Sometimes I'll stand here because I've said this before, standing up puts less pressure on my body. It hurts my legs after a while but um, I do feel like I don't like lying down all the time so standing here has been okay. Um, I'm going to wait on my darling and then we'll have breakfast because He's set up last night, he, I'm not sure entirely what he did, but I know he's gonna make some potato rosties this morning. So, should I make a coffee? No, you know what I'll do? I'll drink some water now, and then I'll wait for my darling to wake up, and then we'll have breakfast and coffee together. I have had a very, very, very productive morning. I think I'm gonna do the same tomorrow. I'm gonna to wake up very early and um, do a few hours of laptop bits and bobs. And I also started reading the second part of the life coaching course. Um, I'm not able to do the assignments until the first part has been signed off. So um, yeah, I just started doing a bit of reading. I can hear my darling. My darling is awake. It's not that early anymore. It's nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Um, yeah, we're gonna get. I'm gonna go get. <laughs> oh, Amma's here too. The whole gang is here. Amma's here. Morning. <laughs> My darling's still waking up. So um, yeah, I'm gonna go get ready for the day um, because I've been in pajamas. Let's go get ready. What time do you guys wake up every morning? Like, are you a morning person or a night person? I feel like I'm gonna wake up every morning and just get bits done. It makes me feel like I've done a lot, like there's a lot of tick, tick, ticks. <laughs> I'm gonna put on a little bit of powder on my eyes. No concealer, nothing like that. Just a little bit of powder. And put on some mascara. This is the Body Shop one.
I need to get a new mascara. This one's dried out. Um, every morning, what I've been doing is I've been weighing myself, like, just so that I'm keeping an eye on my weight because you guys know one of the first symptoms for me was I lost a lot of weight. Like, it was suddenly I've lost a lot of weight. So what I've been doing is just kind of weighing myself every morning. So, you know what? It's fine. It's good. It's good for me to keep an eye on my weight. Um, not because, like, I'm checking to see how much I've put on or how much I've lost or anything. It's just so that I can see if there's any kind of changes. I'm not loving this mascara, by the way. It's very... I don't know, it's very clumpy. <laughs> Matt and I decided, because it's quite early, we thought we'll go to the shops and then we'll come back and then have breakfast. Um, I'm not that hungry, so I just said, let's go to the shops. Um, basically, we need to get a suitcase. My darling suitcase is broken. My <laughs> one is, um, I don't even know where mine is. It's in the loft, but yeah, basically I want a brand new suitcase because I feel like if we both have a new suitcase, it will it'll push us, it will definitely push me to kind of like book a holiday and things. I feel like I've been very anxious about booking holidays and things because I'm worried about like my situation, I'm worried about my bum, I'm worried about my stoma bag, so there's a lot that I'm thinking about, so I feel like the first step is to get a suitcase um, and then, yeah, and then we'll figure it out. But we're going to go to HomeSense as well. Um, I don't know, do HomeSense, do HomeSense sell suitcases? Yeah. Yeah? yeah so we're we'll go have a look. Uh, I'm not sure. Where do you buy a suitcase from? I don't know, but we'll just go look at HomeSense and have a look around there. It'll be nice to go now because... What is it, darling? I have no idea where else you are. Yeah, I don't know. We'll have a look at HomeSense and then I just thought, because it's so nice and early, I'm sure it's not going to be really busy. It'll be really nice and calm and quiet. I feel like if we go later on, um, it might be a bit hectic. I don't know, I just feel like any excuse to go to HomeSense, really. You want to try it now? Yeah. Yummy. Hmm. Matt made overnight oats. There's no oats in it. Chia seed. Overnight Nature. chia seeds. Hmm. Overnight chia seeds. Yeah. No oats. I think you're gonna like it. Mmm. It's strawberry. Mhm. Mm and cherry. What do you think? It needs oats. Yeah. Ugh. I like chia seed. Nice though. There's something called pi. Do you know what piasum is? Do you know what piasum is? It's basically like a Sri Lankan dessert. That's what this reminds me of. Piasum. Is it like that? Mmm. Mmm. Mm. I'm gonna need a bit more, I think. I can taste a fruit. I think about the fruit. What is it? But mango. Frozen fruit. Mmm. Like mix. It's nice. It's very nice. That's really good, like if you're. And it's quite easy to eat. Yeah, and it's really good if you're like really hot. You know, when I get my hot flushes, mm. that'd be great just to have that. We're in the car. My darling's drunk. Have you said hi? Hello. <laughs> it's a little <laughs> bit cold. Um, yeah. So what was I going to say? I was saying to Matt, how nice is it that today? Our plan is just to go to Home Sense. Normally, we'd have to go to the hospital and then we work around like what appointment we have and what scan we have, and you know, and we're always like running behind and nothing's ever on time. So, it's just nice that today everything's like up to us, it's like our timing. <laughs> we're here, we've made it. It's freezing, yeah, it's cold. To take it the first one, eh? Yeah. Oh wow, they got so <gasps> many. They've got loads of suitcases. Yikers. We've just walked in and look, the back is full of suitcases. Should we get matching suitcases? What colour do you want? We got this blue. <laughs> I see a we got this suitcase. This one. This is too big, yeah.
hold on. I can't vlog, we've got too much. I vlog in the car. We were in there for such a long time. Um, Matt's just taking the car out. Yeah, we were in there for such a long time. I am so hungry now. Um, are you hungry, darling? Yeah, so hungry. I didn't expect us to stay in there for that long. Mm. Every time we go there, yeah. we should know, right? That Eat first. Yeah, because we spend so long in there. Okay, we did it. We yeah. did it. I'll show you the bits that we got when we get home, but I need to eat first, so I'll eat and then show you guys because I'm very, very hungry and I need a coffee as well. So you know how we went into HomeSense for suitcases? We actually didn't get any. We are home. I might got you this. For you? No, it's for you. Why? It's nice, isn't it? Why? 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 It's nice, isn't it? It's a little bag for you. I saw it and I was like, you're always saying you need a little side bag. It's, it's just simple. You've got little compartments for your card, bits and bobs. Yeah, I don't think I'm leaving the house today. I think that's it for the day. I'm going to go and get changed into my cozy clothes. I'm going to wear leggings and just feel cozy because I'm wearing jeans, right? I'm wearing these jeans and I feel like, you know when I wear the jeans, it's a bit sore when I wear it for too long around like my tummy and bottom, so I've had it on for a couple of hours, I'm going to take them off. Let me have a piece of toast. It's just um, plain toast with butter. Mm. I want to show you what we bought. I'm still chewing. No. <laughs> yeah, I'll just show you quickly so then I can help with breakfast. Um, we got this, what's this called? Like. Um, cloths, just, it comes with two, so there's two cloths, we thought we'll use this just for the coffee machine because right now the cloth that we're using, we're kind of using it for everything, so this is just solely for the coffee machine. Um, drying cloths? Drying cloths, so we've got some drying cloths, we've got this colour because it's blue and it matches the cloth and it max matches the accents in the kitchen. It comes with, it comes in four. Nice, isn't it? It's really nice, it's really nice material. I like it. I got this. This is my favourite. This is my favourite, yeah. This is my favourite truffle. Like, if someone was to say, Tiffany, what's your favourite chocolates that are truffles? It's these ones. Yeah, they would be. They would definitely be like five or six pounds. The five or six pounds, I don't know. But here, it was three pounds seventy-nine. Is it still in date? Yeah, this is still in date. So, I've got some Monty Bajangles. Then we got this. We got quite a bit of things, so yeah, we got this, we got silicone tongs. This, the reason why we got this is, you know when we're cooking chicken or prawns or vegetables, I don't know, we could just like, you guys know what tongs are. And also, we saw this hack, uh, Matt saw this hack online, and basically when you make spaghetti, you can like present it really nice. If you have these tongs, you can like make it look really good. I'll show you that. Yeah, it's all nice and rolled up and you put the sauce on top. Are we making spaghetti tonight? Yeah. Okay, so when we make spaghetti tonight, I'll show you. Hopefully it works. It, and if it doesn't, it doesn't matter because we'll still need these tongs. Practice, yeah. yeah. Then I got this little bottle. The reason why I bought this bottle is because I want to start making ginger and lemon shots. And before, when I used to work, I used to buy them, like from the shop. I used to buy ginger shots and lemon shots. Like, you know those little mini shots and I thought instead of buying it because they're very expensive I thought I could make it like make a batch and then store this away in the fridge and then I could probably make three or four shots out of this darling would you try some if I make it as well yeah. but I haven't ever made a ginger lemon <clears throat> shot before so I will look online and then I'll store this in the fridge and I just thought this is such a cute bottle how much was it it wasn't that much, otherwise I wouldn't have bought it. It was 2 99 yeah, so it wasn't too much. Then I got this, this little glass, I can't open it. Basically, the reason why I bought this is because I thought I could make overnight oats, put it in the fridge and store it and then have it in the morning. Matt got one for himself. This is for like on the go because Matt goes out for work. <laughs> Matt goes out for work. Matt um, has 
breakfast at work so this will be good again for overnight oats granola or yogurt and fruits and yogurt and granola it's nice and it's 4.99 so again that's good and it comes with a little fork and a little and a spoon i really like it it's cute then i got three candles because all the candles in the house is all winter themed and christmas themed so i need to get some new candles got this this is called morning mist darling you picked this one up didn't you i think you like this yeah it's very nice yeah. mm. it smells very um fresh morning mist this is nice and then we got this candle which i liked which is called clear quartz vanilla this is more deeper so i think in the evenings we'll probably have this one on and then i got another candle the last candle which is this it's called white lavender and i thought when i meditate and well i'm going to start getting into meditation again so yeah <laughs> i thought this candle will be nice for that and it's just i love the smell of lavender i used to hate it i honestly used to hate the smell of lavender but I find that lavender just makes me feel really calm and I don't know when I was younger I just I just didn't like the smell now I love it and then again Matt saw this this is so 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 nice for a plant in the house even that plant no not that one guess how much this was yeah how did you know did you know did you look it was 9.99 I think that's really good for a nice plant pot usually like if you look in the garden center a plant pot is like 30 40 quid Normally in the garden centre, a plant pot like this would be a lot more money. So this is good, very good. That's everything we got. Now I'm gonna eat some breakfast. <laughs> Mummy is going to my sister's. My oh yeah, she bought this tahini. Mm -hmm. um, tahini. It's vegan and gluten free, this isn't it? Spread tahini. I I feel like tahini is used for something. I just yeah. don't know. Tahini. It's like a dressing. Is it used for yeah, dressing? dressing? Yeah. Yeah, like salad. Yeah. yeah. I think so. I feel like I know what I've heard of tahini. I've never used it. Tahini is a hummus. Hummus, yeah. Sesame, sesame. sesame seed spread. So mm. she's taking that to my sister. So Mama's going to my sister's. She's going to spend time with Aston and Ella. Bye bye. Bye, Emma. See you. Love eat you. Bread, yeah, I'm going to eat. Bye. Eat more, yeah. Bye bye. Good dinner. Yummy. Let's separate the chunky bit. Yeah, just so you can start cooking it a wee bit. This is breakfast, so we've got potato rosti, I got scrambled egg, my darling got fried egg, brown rosti, sauce. brown sauce, I made a ham sandwich as well, made Matt a ham butty, ham mm. in a bun. Mm, did um, you try it? Not yet, no. Oh sorry darling, I didn't wait for you, <laughs> sorry. Gum, mm. yummy. Rosti is honestly a game changer for breakfast. I took a bite out of the sandwich already. just made myself a coffee. I made it like extra hot today, like extra foamy and extra bubbly. Mm, that's good, that's nice and creamy. Warm. I'm just opening this up. I'm gonna have... So it looks like this. It's just so small. It's like a little tiny chocker for your coffee. I'm gonna enjoy my chocker. I'm gonna go read this now. It's a little bit later, I'm just going to clean the kitchen, clean just because we didn't wash up the dishes so we're going to do that now. <laughs> dishes all washed, kitchen is looking clean. Um, I've also washed, you know, the bits that we got from HomeSense, I've just kind of done a deep clean of that as well so I'll start using that soon. I'm thinking, I, just, I don't think we have enough ginger and lemon for me to make my ginger shot. So I'm gonna go to the shops, I think, and get some ginger and lemon, and then maybe do that tomorrow. Put that plant in this pot. Yeah. Cause that's got holes in the bottom. And put that in the other. And then put this in there. This is the only one that's managed like the winter, isn't it? Only poppies survive. We're trying to look for a plant for our new pot. Um, this is too small. I'm not gonna lie, the plants aren't looking the best. Yeah, but it's winter, isn't it? It is winter, but does that mean all the plants have died? They'll get better too. What, with some sunlight? Uh, yeah. 
I'm never gonna buy, I said this to your brother darling, I'm never gonna buy plants from the garden centre again unless I love them because plants from the garden centre is very very expensive and to see them look like this is actually heartbreaking what was I meant to do? bring them in the house? like I don't know what I was meant to do, what was the right thing to do like it needed protection and I didn't protect it which makes me sad, I didn't protect my plants and I love, do you know what I love the most? oh look darling, the one my sister got me looks fine I guess I wasn't really thinking about my plants when I had so much going on, but I'm going to do everything to try and save them. How though? How? Ooh, that looks nice. I was watching um, YouTube videos and TikTok videos on this lemon ginger drink, and the best way to do it is to juice it, um, because I have a juicer. If not, I could use the blender and then sieve it out. I'm not sure what which method I'm going to go for, um, but what I'll do, what I thought I should do is go to the shops, um, we need to pick up bits for dinner anyways, and then pick up bits for the lemon and ginger drink. Um, I'm going to write a shopping list, I think. Yeah, I'm going to write a shopping list, hold on. So we need... Um, we need lemon, ginger, coconut water, orange, granola, oat milk, chicken. I wrote a quick shopping list. We'll quickly go to the shops. Um, I think I'm going to walk to the shops because I feel like walking because we've been kind of lounging about in the house. It'll be nice to kind of walk to the shops because the weather's okay. Get that big piece. That's enough, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, oh my gosh, that's brilliant. We're home, we're home. I'm a little bit tired, I was just saying to Matt, I'm a little bit tired, but I think it's where I woke up super early um, and I'm tired. <laughs> okay, so we got some granola, um, but you know what, next time I think I'm gonna learn how to make my own granola just because I feel like it will taste nicer. So, but for now, we've just got a bag of granola, some cayenne pepper, because apparently this in the ginger shot is meant to be really good. So cayenne pepper, but I'm also gonna put in some black pepper, some desiccated coconut, which would be nice for our overnight oats. We've got a big ginger, we've got four lemons, got some vanilla, yogurt again i just love vanilla yogurt or cherry yogurt we usually buy the one that's on like sale and this one was on sale <laughs> i don't think i'm gonna make the ginger drip juice today because i am i can't do it today i'm probably gonna do it tomorrow or yeah i'll figure it out i need to figure out the best kind of way of making it and then um once I figure it out, I'll let you know. If you have like your way or if you know a way, please let me know as well because that would be good. Because it's like nicer flavor. Okay, and just a little bit of red chili. That's a small red chili. Yeah. Garlic, yeah? Mm. And then will you smell this? And I just chuck this on top. What I'm gonna do whilst Matt is making dinner, I'm gonna make the overnight oats for Matt and for myself because Matt has work tomorrow and I <laughs> I have to wake up early because I have a lot of studying to do. And he, you know when we went to HomeSense we both bought little jars. Are they called jars? Yeah, little jars. Yeah. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna make the overnight oats in here. Oh, this comes up really nicely. We need some chia seeds. Oats, oat milk, yeah. yogurt, chia seeds, and honey. Mm, let me see it. You put honey in here as well? Honey. Nice. This is the chia seeds that I use for my overnight oats. You know online, I saw people using Biscoff, like they melt the Biscoff. That's and such a like, great idea. Oh, it must taste so nice. But yeah. what I'm going to do is, I'm going to try and see how this tastes tomorrow. Yeah, that will be delicious. Yeah. And if it's nice, and if I feel like I want it a little bit sweeter, I will try the Biscoff method and see how that is. Don't you need one of these? I don't. <laughs> you do need one of these, look at that. 
<laughs> let me <laughs> ask. Wait, hold on, guys. That's <laughs> unreal. <laughs> I absolutely love. No, nope, this is better. Okay, I love my little like glass overnight oat situation. Rubbish, Matt likes rubbish. this because he. <laughs> so that. when we keep saying, I keep saying mine's better, and he keeps saying yeah, his is better. Like that? I've got I've got a spoon here. I don't need Look one. That. <laughs> Which one do you guys like, Matt? Or, Matt's That's one better. or mine? His he's gonna like take to work. Mine's at home, so. Yeah, but look at that. No That's the granola we, in there. <laughs> That's the we got this. <laughs> That's why we got this granola bar. We got this yogurt. We got this yogurt tin. So I'm going to put that on mine. This is what the sauce is looking like. Matt's added the pepper and the salt. Oh, that's enough. I feel like this is going to be a very, very long video and I am so sorry because I know some of you absolutely hate my long videos. Um, I just feel like today I felt like picking up the camera a lot more. Okay, I'm going to try some of this. Do you want your piece? Yeah, I'll get some. Tagliatelle. Tagliatelle. Mm. Nice, isn't it? I'm still kind of standing up, Matt's sitting down. That's why it looks like we're very close together. You're used to me standing up for dinner now, aren't mm. you? <laughs> I feel we love pasta. We love tomato sauce. So I think we need to go to mm -hmm. Italy. I do think we need to go to Italy. Okay, I'm going to carry on eating dinner with my lovely mutt. Um, I hope you're all having a lovely evening. Thank you for being with me for the whole day. Let me know if you've reached this part of the video. Like, it's such a long video, but let me know if you've reached to the end. I love you all a lot, a lot, a lot. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and join my loving Tiffany Thanks family. Yeah, I think that's okay. Sorry, my camera shut off. My Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok is Tiffany Thanks, and I will see you in my next video. I love you. Bye. Mwah. I'm gonna say bye. Bye. <laughs>